Hey there guys, Chet here. Now listen, I need to give you a quick but very important warning. If you're looking for a free alternative to Microsoft Office, you will probably find a tool called Apache Open Office. Do not download it. While it was once one of the most important and popular free software projects in the world, it is now considered a dead end by most people. There is a much better, safer, and more powerful option you should be using instead. In this video, we're going to do a quick review of Apache Open Office and explain why you should use its modern successor, LibreOffice. So what is Apache Open Office? For many years, it was the original king of free office software. It is a complete office suite that you can download to your computer. Now it has a word processor called Writer, a spreadsheet program called Calc, and a presentation tool called Impress. For a long time, it was the best free alternative to Microsoft Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, and it was used by millions of people. Its history is the most important part of the story. Now let's take a step back. Back in 2010, the project split in two. The majority of the developers and the community left to create a new, more modern version of the software, which they called LibreOffice. The original open office name was eventually given to Apache Foundation. This is where the program, or this is where the problem is today. Since that split happened more than a decade ago, development on Apache OpenOffice has slowed down to almost nothing. It very rarely receives any significant updates. This means that it is missing many of the modern features that you would expect from an Office suite. More importantly, it can have security problems that are not getting fixed quickly because there are so few developers still working on it. Meanwhile, LibreOffice has been actively and rapidly developed by a huge global community. LibreOffice gets major updates with new features and better performance every six months. It also has much better compatibility with the latest Microsoft Office file formats. LibreOffice is the true living version of the project today. So what is my final review of Apache OpenOffice? It is a historically important piece of software that paved the way for all of the free office tools that we have today. We have to respect its legacy above all, but as a tool to actually use in 2025, I can't recommend it. It's outdated, it lacks modern features, and it is not actively maintained, which can be a huge security risk. For every single person looking for a free and powerful office suite, the clear and correct choice is to download LibreOffice instead. It is everything that OpenOffice was supposed to be, but made modern and secure. All right, that's it for this review. I hope this historical breakdown helps you understand the difference and choose the right free office suite. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.